Hello friends, this is Normal Hefer Technique and in this video we will share a simple WhatsApp trick wherein you can use the WhatsApp as a bookmarking and note taking application. So we already know that WhatsApp is now the most popular social messenger out there and uh, almost all age groups use WhatsApp irrespective of the platform. It's available in almost all platforms and uh, this is one of the most popular apps uh, on your smartphone. So without doubt uh, WhatsApp is used uh, across the world. So uh, being uh, the most popular app on your smartphone, you can also use WhatsApp Messenger as a bookmarking platform as well as note taking application. So this is a simple trick uh, uh, before going into the trick we'll uh, let our viewers know that this is not a, a new trick this has been used by many users but then uh, we thought uh, we'll share this with our uh, viewers so that in case you're not using it you can uh, start using this uh, trick and uh, use the whatsapp messenger as a note taking and bookmarking application. So uh, now let's go into how to get started with this. So for that uh, first you need to create a group. So uh, when you create a group you need to add a person to the group uh, so that uh, at least one person is needed to uh, add to the group so that you can uh, create a group. So for this uh, uh, trick you can add uh, someone close to you say for example someone in your relatives or your close friend you can add because you are, once you add them you are going to instantly remove them as well. So you can just tell them that you are just trying out some group. Uh, uh, trick so first step uh, you need to open now uh, whatsapp so first step let's open whatsapp and again uh, see the whatsapp interface now click uh, here and uh, create a new group so you can just uh, select a new group and uh, select participants so for time being you will just uh, add a person here so i'll just add my uh, other number so i'm just creating a group I'll just add the uh, group name as my bookmarks. So, just added the group. So, you can see that I have created a new group called my bookmarks, and now we have a person you have added here. So, you can see here you have added a person uh, to the bookmarks. Now, what you can do is uh, go to that bookmarks and uh, you can just remove that person. So just uh, once you add it, just remove that person. So since you have already told that person that you are going to remove after creating the group, so you don't have to worry on that. So now we have uh, created a bookmarks and uh, you can see that you are the only participant in the group uh, since you have deleted the other person. Now what you can do is uh, you can write any uh, notes on this. Uh, uh, this group so you can type any messages into this group and you are the only person who have access and you can see these uh, uh, messages and whatever shares you get on other groups uh, or uh, individually you get you can just add to or sh share to this my bookmarks which means all the bookmarks will be available in this group and you can access them now if you might ask uh, whatsapp has already a bookmarking option when you uh, favorite that uh, uh, a status message or a link you already have that uh, favorite messaging option in book uh, whatsapp so what uh, difference does it make with this group uh, here what you can do is you can also add uh, other links external links can be added here because you can only favorite um, uh, links and uh, messages which are already in your whatsapp account but other links external links say, say you uh, you read a really interesting article and you want to bookmark it the only option generally is to bookmark uh, via the browser you can add bookmarks in the browser also, but then when you uh, tap uh, share and you can just share the article to your group that is my bookmarks and the link will be available here without any access to other people and you can also use uh, this to read any any time because if you open the my bookmarks group you are the only person who have shared uh, articles uh, links uh, photos videos etc and everything will be available there and you can also access uh, uh, through web application and if you transfer your phone you can always sing all these details and get Get a hold of all your bookmarks in a new smartphone as well. So this is a very useful uh, option that is uh, just create a, a new group and add a participant to the group and you can just uh, remove them once a group is created and uh, now uh, the group has only you as a participant and you can uh, start adding uh, links and other stuffs to this group. Now when you come across a, an article say for example we have just opened our website and you can see an article what you can do is just uh, hit the chrome share and uh, you can just get hold of uh, the whatsapp share via whatsapp and you can just uh, click here and then uh, share to your bookmarks and uh, click send 
and what you can do is you can see that uh, uh, the, f the article or the link has been shared in your bookmarks folder so this is a very handy and uh, useful mechanism on whatsapp wherein you can create your own bookmarks and note taking application uh, using the group functionality this is not a new trick because a lot of users are you already using it and uh, we have just uh, created this video uh, in case you are not using it you can try this trick and you can use a group uh, for all your bookmarks uh, including uh, notes, uh, images, videos and all of the steps which uh, WhatsApp support. You can create your own uh, space and uh, this will not be accessible to anyone and you can uh, even uh, move these uh, links and documents uh, when you transfer to a new phone. So that's a simple uh, trick wherein you can create a bookmark folder and uh, also note taking application within WhatsApp. So that's all guys with a simple trick on creating a bookmarks folder in WhatsApp. Hope this video was useful and if you like this video do hit the like button and also share with your friends on how to create this uh, simple trick and uh, use the WhatsApp effectively. So that's all guys. Don't forget to hit the red subscribe button for more tricks. Uh, thanks for watching and hope to see you in our next video.